rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Today I'll be showing you how to set up the Arabic language settings for, so you can proceed with the installation for Al Maktabatu Shamila. Number one, you'll have to add the Arabic language into your preferences. So you can simply go into control panel and then add a language. And this will be similar for previous Windows users. You just add a language from here. Open Arabic. Select Arabic Saudi Arabia from the options. And add it in. And from the options, if you haven't installed the language pack, you can install it here. Um, this should be left load. Once you have done that, you will be able to type in Arabic. However, to actually run Arabic programs, you will have to go through region, which is here. Or you can just search it up on the bottom. For previous Windows users, it will be named region and language settings, and you will come across this. You go onto the administrative tab and change the long language for non Unicode programs from English to Arabic Saudi Arabia. And once this is done, it will request you to restart the computer. And this should eventually allow you to run Arabic programs and to type in Arabic. The way to change between language input is through this button here. This should appear after you have set up more than one language. You select Arabic here. Or a shortcut for Windows 10 users is to click the, to press the Windows button along with the spacebar, then you can switch between the languages. This will be the end of my first video, and in the second video, I will show you how to download and set up Al Maktabatul Shamila. Jazakumullahu khair.